Hello guys, welcome back to my another After Effects tutorial, in this tutorial, we are going to see, how to create, photo slideshow animation in After Effects, so without any wait, let's see the preview. You can see, here I have already imported the media file and the light leak media file require for our slideshow, you can download the light leak media file from below link in the description. So now let's start creating our photo slideshow. So let's begin with creating a new composition. Let's name it as slide 1. As usual width and height is set to 1920 by 1080 pixels. Make sure frame rate is set to 30 frames per second. Now set the time duration to 3 seconds. Now let's add media file to timeline. You can scale your media file if needed. Here I will slightly scale my media file. Now let's pre-compose the image. Name it as image. Now let's change image composition to 3D. Now let's create duplicate of image composition. Press Ctrl plus D to create duplicate. Now select below image composition. Press T to bring up the opacity. Now set the opacity to 50%. Now select the rectangle tool. Now we need to create frame structure. Let's do it. This will be our outer frame. Let's align it to the center. Now let's create inner frame. Now for shape layer 1. Change track mat to alpha inverted mat shape layer 2. Now for image 1 composition, let's adjust the scale value. Press S to bring up the scale. Now adjust the scale value to near about 50%. Now we need to adjust the position of image and frame. Perfect. You can also adjust the shape layer to fit the image composition. In this empty space you can add your text. Now select image composition and shape layers. Pre-compose them. Name it as frame. Now let's change frame composition to 3D. Now for frame composition, press P to bring up the position. Now for the position, 
press Alt key and select the stopwatch, this will open the expression tab. Now enter expression, wiggle 5 comma 4. Now for image composition. Press P to bring up the position. Now slightly increase position value for Z axis. Now you can see the preview. Perfect. Now for image 1 composition. Select ellipse tool. Now draw mask over the image composition as shown. Now we need to adjust mask feather value and mask expansion value. Perfect. Now for image 1 composition. Now in effects and preset, search for CC radial fast blur. Now add it to image composition. Perfect. Now for frame composition. In effects and preset, search for drop shadow. Add it to frame composition. Now for drop shadow, set distance value to near about 14. Now set softness value to 90. Now for frame composition. Press R to bring up rotation. Now for Z rotation, create a keyframe. Change rotation value to 1 degree. Now at 1 second. Change rotation value to 0 degree. Now at 2 seconds. Change rotation value to minus 1 degree. Now let's create a new camera. Now create a new null object. Now parent camera to null object. Change null object to 3D. Now for null object press P to bring up the position. Now create a keyframe for position. Now at start of the timeline. Change position value for Z axis as shown. Now at 15 frames. Change position value for Z axis to 0. Now at 1 second and 15 frames. Create a keyframe for position. Now at 2 seconds, change the position of Z axis as shown. Now let's see the preview. Perfect. Now let's add the light leak media file to timeline. For light leak change mode to screen. Now let's see the preview. Perfect. Similarly you can create more slides and create your slideshow. Thank you guys for watching this tutorial. If you like this tutorial, then make sure to like and share this video, and also subscribe to my channel. Thank you.